field as well. And it's Rohan Mustafa who's come in to open the batting. This is good from Abu Dhabi. They're not going to take it easy. Again, long tournament. Net run rate is going to play a key role as well. Salman, you can see, just going down towards the legs. Oh, poor effort in the field. Well, this seems to be the problem with the Emirates Reds. And they have conceded a needless boundary. Would have been three dot balls, but in the end, it's four. Feel like 14, 15 years of age in the hot spot, as you were saying, Ali. Mm. It's a good move. Sending Rohan up the order. Experience up the order. And against a left arm spinner, it's always handy. A left hand batter. Match to, but he'll have to play a role. This should be sensible because the intent is pretty clear. Anything in the zone, they're going to go after. Regardless if they're chasing 84, they're going to go and go hard at the bowling lineup. As you said, net run rate will come. Charges down the track this time. And they take the single. The standards that we have seen so far, I think that shouldn't be a problem for them. <laughs> they seem to be in a hurry. They want to go back to Abu Dhabi on time. Oh, that is picked up beautifully. Full toss, utilized, over cover. Calling by his partner, denying the second one. Otherwise, it would have definitely be a run out. Ball with that tight line and length. That is why they're so handy. Look at that start. It's been played towards long off. Only one run. Because of their tight line and length, they get so difficult, even for a left-hander, to get them away. Oh, not happy, Rohan Mustafa, because he wanted to. Again, what the format is. No, again goes inside out, over extra, one bounce into the fence for four. Of course, hmm. but these three teams look like the teams to beat. Now, Neil Hegde has done them a massive favor. First ball, hmm. five extra runs conceded. It brings up a smile on your face too, because you want to go <laughs> home early too. Four. Nice wrist work. Nice wrist work. You can clearly show the difference in quality and running between the wickets too. That's exactly what you pointed out early. When as long as they stay, he is a prize wicket if you can get Rohan out. Yeah, absolutely. But don't forget the basics. Mm. 50 partnership for the opening wicket. Oh, it's an outside edge. A bit unlucky there, Neil. But I would consider Rohan Mustafa has done that deliberately to get a four. Yeah, having third inside this leg side and a bit too leg side-ish. Well, I'd like him to come over the wicket maybe because that angle is not working for him around the wicket. Again, a slash. Again, down towards third man for a boundary. Well, it's either side of the wicket and that's the problem right there. Either it's down the leg side or way outside off stump and Rohan Mustafa is capitalizing. Absolutely, he's toying around with him. He's just moving around the crease, making him ball those will give him this boundary. Even the edge will give him a boundary. Yeah, absolutely. 100% there. That was very deliberate indeed from Rohan Mustafa. 16 runs conceded, three legal deliveries still to go. This could be a massive over. Again, he's guided it this time. They have a fielder deep. And a fumble, they will take two. You do not make a mistake with Rohan Mustafa running between the wickets, Rashid Habib. Yeah, they're getting two easy runs. Very, very easy runs. And with over, very expensive over from Neil so far. Again, down the leg side. And this time, he gets bat on it. Sends it towards the fine leg boundary. 22 runs have been conceded. One more leg. He's a character and a half. This time, guides it over, third man, over point, beg your pardon. Well, 26 runs have come off the over. And it's been an absolute masterclass from Rohan Mustafa in terms of batting. Uh, quality, quality batting. Look at that. Gave himself room, just timed it. More he bats, more will be entertained. Well, at the halfway stage, Abu Dhabi. And absolutely cruising here. 69 for no loss and a 5. Yeah, that was a golden opportunity for Emirates Reds to win the game, pick up some points. Oh, he's hit the boundary. And they've not needed over number 7, the Abu Dhabi team. What a statement victory this from the men in yellow. Rohan Mustafa finishes on 43 of 20.
Kamran Atla, 34 of 16. Abu Dhabi have chased down 84 with 4 today. And as I was mentioning with Ali Mudassir, I think these three teams. Well, that's the batting card. Mr. Fikar Ali, he's got the player of the match memento in his hand. Quite a few notable performances today. Kamar Hassan, uh, he scored uh, 36 of 25. Kamran Atta, of course, scored 34 of 16 deliveries. But the player of the match today is uh, somebody who scored 43 runs of just 20 balls. And with the ball in his hand, he also got a wicket to his name. No surprises there. The player of the match is Rohan Mustafa. And he'll be handed over the player of the match memento by our match referee, Mr. Iftigar Ali. <laughs> Congratulations, Rohan. Uh, how do you rate your performance? Tell us uh, how did you feel batting and batting at the top and then getting a wicket to your name as well. Uh, first of all, thanks to Ella. Of course, it was great performance from the team. Winning with 10 wickets, the score is great. But honestly, I don't uh, love to play T10. But somehow you have to play because you get opportunity, whatever cricket it is. Uh, but, uh, you know, I believe uh, I have played a lot of T10 and whatever in domestic as well. I believe it's a luck game and whenever it's your day, you do very well. And I think today was my day. I started well. Uh, Left arm spinner, I didn't hit well, but honestly, when I started middling the ball and it was going, that's it.